Hi you guys, welcome back to reading the word and understanding the Bible verse. Today I read Deuteronomy chapter 13 and chapter 14. What I find interesting is chapter 13 starting in verse 3. It says, You must not listen to the word of the prophet or dreamers. The Lord your God is testing you to find out whether you love him with all your heart and with all your soul. It is the Lord your God you must follow and him. You must revere and keep his commands and obey him, serve him, and hold fast to him. So this is really interesting and this is really cool because God was testing the Israelites. And what's really cool is this goes all the way back to, um, this goes back later on when Jesus was getting tested, when Jesus came down. And Jesus was getting tested by Satan, and Satan said, turn those rocks into bread. And Jesus told Satan, you can't survive on bread alone. So this is really cool and really interesting because Jesus was even getting tempted by Satan. And so are we. We get tempted by Satan all the time. And the only way we're going to understand who's preaching correctly and who's preaching wrongly is by growing in our word, accepting Jesus Christ in your heart as Lord and Savior, number one. And number two is reading his Bible daily, understanding it and learning from it, gaining that knowledge. So then when you do hear other people preach, you can see if they are preaching correctly or if they're, or they're, or they're false prophecy. The only way you could understand that is by reading his word and growing in growing into it every single day. So, it's really cool how God tests the Israelites because we go through that test all the time. It's easier now because we're tested all the time on all the social media apps, on all these different people preaching. You have to understand who's, who's preaching the right word and who's not preaching the right word. The only way you can understand that is by growing in his face. So I hope that helps you guys. I hope that we have a good day and a blessed day today. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. God bless. Love you guys.